So, oh, oh no. But we're gonna fix this one before I put it up there. But this is for my first fake Grand Ole Opry performance in Brazil, North Carolina. This ornament was when I tried out for The Voice. Um, it didn't make it, 2017. For the constant reminder, thanks, Mom. This is a representation of being a songbird. How cute. 2011. This was from um, when, hey, can you please? <laughs> this is from when I went to Paris and the first time I ever went out of the country as well as um, got on a plane, 2019. Mom said I sing like an angel, so she got me this one. Cute. I don't know what the heck this one's for, but it's from 2010. Oh. <laughs> Why don't I just throw it into the tree and just hope for the best? This is just when you need to just put a bunch of limbs under the same ornament so it'll hold it up. This is when I was invited to sing the national anthem. Excuse me. You want us to shut up? Yes. This is when I was invited to Biloxi, Mississippi to sing the national anthem for the, um, the PBR. I made this in 2004. Oh, 2004. It's a little candy cane. Aww. But my friend from church gave me this, and I always thought it was cute, so I kept it. This was also from when I met a bunch of cute cowboys and sang the national anthem for them. So cute. This is from my freshman year of MTSU. This is just a random one that I guess mom didn't feel like hanging up, so she put it in my ornament box. Um, this is from when I went to Nashville for the very first time. Deserves to be up here in the lights. Beautiful. Merry Christmas.